Okay, I want to give you a really quick video on a home air conditioning capacitor. If uh, you go to start your air conditioner this year and it won't seem to cool, won't run, this is the thing you should check first. And you can do this usually with a visual inspection. This is a capacitor, this is a 45.5 um, 440 dual capacitor. And you can see the different uh, areas to hook it up to. Something to look for on a busted capacitor is for something to be bulging out on it. So that is the old one I removed. Here is a brand new one. And you can see the bulging here all around the top, how it's bulged out. And if you look at it from the side, you can kind of see how the, how the connectors kind of have this arch to it. The new one, they're all straight across. And so this part, um, I got at my local supply place for $17. And so you can open up the little access panel to your air conditioner. Be sure and turn the power off to it first. Um, and you can take a look in there and just visually look at it to determine if that might be it. There's not a great way to test these unless you have a, a voltmeter that will test capacitance. Um, capacitance usually rated in farads or microfarads. This 45.5 is a 45 far, uh, microfarad and a 5 microfarad. And that's for running the fan, the compressor, and so forth. So check that out. If you think that yours might be busted, be sure your power's shut off. A capacitor is basically a battery. So as soon as you shut off the power, they can still hold a charge, and they can give you a pretty good zap. So if you don't know what you're doing, it's probably best that you leave it to the professionals. Um, but anyway, that's something to check. And you can check that before you call out an air conditioning repair person. Uh, it might give you an idea if they're about to rip you off or not. So, once again, $17 at the local supply warehouse. And I was able to replace it myself, and that was my problem. So, that's it. Thanks.